I'm shot. Hey there, everybody. Thanks for joining us on TCM. I'm Ben Mankiewicz. 100 years ago, the world first saw the great W.C. Fields on celluloid in the short Pool Sharks. Over the next 30 years, Fields gave some memorable performances on screen, and tonight we have four of those films. And joining me to discuss Fields and his work is his only granddaughter, Dr. Harriet Fields. Among the titles on her impressive resume is Vice President of W.C. Fields Productions Incorporated. Harriet, welcome. Thank you very much. It's an honor to be here. And thank you to TCM and your TCM family. Well, thank you for being here. Up first, one of W.C. Fields' most popular movies from 1940, it's The Bank Dick, a movie that in 1992 became the first of three Fields films added to the Library of Congress's National Film Registry. All right, Harriet, so first of all, I'm going to start with the film's writer, <laughs> Mahatma Cain Jeeves. <laughs> There's no, nobody in the world is named Mahatma Cain Jeeves. Uh, your father, your grandfather, uh, wrote the movie. What was up with his use of pseudonyms in the for for when when he wrote when he wrote movies. Well, you know, one thing I think W.C. was very humble. He wanted to share his art with the world, so he didn't need his name up there as long as his art was out in the world. He said that he, he liked to uh, to study British drama, or, or as he said in one of his films, English drawing room drama. <laughs> <laughs> and um, at the end, they'd always say, my hat, my cane, Jeeves. Usually the butler's name oh, was right, Jeeves. Oh, right, Jeeves, of course, right. So that's, I mean, that's a parody, you know. and, and my that's hat, an, my cane, Jeeves. And that, that's an, uh, a tribute to W.C.'s art. I mean, that's a deep thinker who would put all of that together. So it's not some uh, 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 conflagration of Mahatma Gandhi and Citizen Kane. No, I, but uh, that's nice to think of, too, <laughs> no, isn't I like, it? My hat, <laughs> like my that? cane, Jeeves is better. Um, the W.C. Fields Productions. Uh, what does that company do? What's the stated purpose of that? Well, you know, actually, um, what we do is, and just as W.C. in 1920, and till this day, did not own his films. For the most part, Universal does. Uh, but we've maintained very cordial relationships. We, what we house in the W.C. Fields Productions is, the, my brothers and I, we own the rights to the image and likeness and internet Inter intellectual property of our grandfather. So we monitor licensing, the, the constructive licensing throughout the world of the image and likeness and intellectual property. And since we inherited our grandfather's artifacts and memorabilia, we realized that this material does not belong to us. And I've always thought that it belongs to the world. Well, let me ask you, what did you inherit? So we inherited all his personal letters to his family, to his friends, to his colleagues, his, his working colleagues, um, his uh, letters to the directors, producers, his scripts with his personal handwriting, because you know That's even the That's incredibly valuable. I don't mean in terms of money. I just mean that would be great, great to look at. Well, it, this is part of what we've done. Um, it, it's just a treasure. So the Library of Congress wanted it, Smithsonian wanted it, but we placed it, and I'm so glad we did, at the Academy of Motion Picture Arts and Sciences, Margaret Herrick Library. So they were immediately able to catalog it, archive it, preserve it, and now it's accessible to the public. Let's talk briefly uh, about this movie, a very famous W.C. Fields movie, uh, The Bank Dick. Um, in, in many of his movies, uh, it's sort of about the manner in which he triumphs over his Nuji family. Yes. Uh, where did that come from? Well, you know, W.C. is really profiling the family life that, somewhat, that he inherited, not the life that he always wanted. So there's a, there's a, a friction in family life. There's a contention. You know, in the bank tick, we have a contention with the mother-in-law. Yeah. But, and people have commented to us, he always kept the family together, and That's that right. was a goal. And I think that was a pain of his, that through his life, he always wanted that family to stay together. And he did it till the very end when my father married my mother, and he started to have grandchildren. And he was finally able to get the family life that he wanted. And we have a quote from W.C. Fields, and it said, and it's a theme through his films, and it's touching to us. He said, always keep with your family. 
They'll try to take them away from you. Don't let them. Always stay with your family. And that's what we're trying to do as well through W.C. Fields Productions and share our inheritance with the world as, as often as we can. So this is certainly a help with what you're doing. Harriet, thank you very much. Thank you. Here's the movie from 1940. It's a film Harriet's brothers Ron and Alan introduced at this year's TCM Classic Film Festival in Hollywood. It's W.C. Fields in the bank deck. Thank you.